Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. I am Cher. And so previously I did a little video where we did a battle of the blushes based on a recent makeup haul that I did with a lot of new and trending makeup, new releases and all. We're going to kind of have like a part two and this time we're going to have a battle of the lips from that same haul. So this is just going to be a trending new release makeup battle. Um, we're going to see if we're going to find some dupes. As I mentioned in the other video, e.l.f. has really been bringing it lately. So we're especially going to be looking at the new uh, Clout Pout, no, Pout Clout Plumping Pins that just came out. And I'm thinking that they're a dupe for the Tarte Maracucha Lip Balms, which I absolutely love. I'm also going to be trying out a couple other little lip products. And so if you're curious and want the review and see if we can do a little rankings and see if we find a dupe, then stick around and we'll hop right on in. So let's walk through some of the lippies I'm going to be testing out today. So this is mostly going to be more on the lip oil, lip balm, or lip jelly side. We're not doing like lipsticks and that kind of stuff. It's going to be more like the very moisturizing, um, balmy type products. And this is just something I'm really into. I honestly rarely ever reach for like matte or uh, regular cream lipstick anymore. I usually pop on a lip liner and then I do some kind of like hydrating something or other. I don't even do gloss anymore because it's too what's the word? Not oil-based. Um, it's just, you know, it's a different finish. I'm really more into the oils and the balms and occasionally these jelly finishes too. So, um, this is what we're going to be running through. So the first thing we're going to do is we're definitely going to test out some e.l.f. Um, I have a sample of Tarte, of the Tarte Maracucha, that I'm testing it against. I used to have different shades, but I've used them up because I love those things and I use the snot out of them. So we're gonna test these against that one. Um, then we have the very popular Summer Fridays Lip Oil. So I'm gonna be trying this out. I don't know what I'm gonna compare it to, but I do have a few other, like I really love the I Do Care. Um, they're not going to be the same shades, but this one I think is a little similar. This is the Nourishing Vitamin C Lip Oil. I've talked about this in a Beauty Faves video before. Probably one of my favorites there. So I'm thinking I might kind of compare it to that. And then I also want to test the Summer Fridays. I mean, it's not the exact same finish, but I kind of want to test Summer Fridays against the e.l.f lip oils also. Like I said, e.l.f. has been a contender in just about everything recently. So we're doing like an e.l.f. face off here to see if e.l.f. is a dupe for all these other very popular good brands. Okay. Um, I also love the Eloise lip oil that we just got in this month's Boxy. Boxy Charm, I think. This was really good. I love it. So another contender. So I've got kind of some favorite ones. Um, and then the last thing I want to do is I really want to do a face-off between the LYS Beauty, these little, uh, their treatment oils, their lippy treatment oils is what they're called, versus the Lancome Juicy Tubes, because they're kind of the same idea, like jelly finishes. And I like both of these, but I kind of want to like test them against each other. So those are the different uh, lip face-offs we're going to do. Let's get into it. Okay, I've gone ahead and prepped my lips with this, but my lips look so dark right now, and it's because of a punch I've been drinking. <laughs> I'm not wearing any lip color. Look at that. <laughs> and my tongue is red. So we're going to try to go over the, the red, but I did put on a liner, and then, so this is uh, Anastasia Beverly Hills, Dusty Rose, one of my favorites. I wear it all the time. I'm going to first, sh should I do like one side tart and one side? Yeah, that's what we'll do. Um, okay. I don't know what shade this is. It just says, oh, rose. Okay. So this is the shade rose on the Tarte Maracucha. Oh. 
I've missed it so much. Mm, feels amazing. I forgot how much I love my tart maracuja and I, I need to go back for another tart order and stock up on these because I love them so much. All right. There's one side. We're going to try, I'm going to go with a lighter shade of the Elf Clout Pout I mean, Pout Clout Lip Plumping Pin, and I don't remember what shade this is. Did they tell us? Why don't they put these things a little more clear? Hold on. I need my glasses. Yeah, I can't read. I don't remember what shade this is, y'all, and it does not say. I'll try to remember the names from my order and put them on the screen for you. Hey, I love that shade, by the way. Whatever it is, I love it. Okay, so I will tell you guys, I have already tried this darker one. Um, let's look at the finish. I feel like the tart's a little bit thicker. Um, I can just feel it like it just feels thicker. The Elf, okay, it's starting to kick in. The Elf feels amazing at first. It goes on. Very moisturizing. Feels so good. So I'd start to say it's a dupe, absolutely. And I really like this color. But here's what happens. After a few minutes, there's this kind of tingling menthol that kicks in. Because it is a plumping pin. Sometimes plumpers sting. It doesn't sting. Like, it's not like really bad, like a stinging that hurts, but there is this slight, like, it has that tightening, tingling sensation that plumpers give off. You know what I mean? Um, and it's a menthol. It's like a minty feeling. It was a lot worse with the darker one. So I'm thinking that the different shades might have more you know, pigment in them of this plump. I don't know. Uh, this one's not too bad, but it's also not on my entire lip like this one was the other day. So um, that's the only thing is I don't like that. I don't like plumpers that sting at all or tingle or anything. I want them all to be like tart where I don't feel any stinging, any tightening, nothing, but they feel amazing on the lips. And I don't know if the tart one is even a plumping one though. I guess it's just a juicy, it's a juicy lip. So maybe that's the difference is that the e.l.f. one is touting at, touted as being plumping. Does this lip look, does this side look plumper than this side? It does actually. So you, okay. So, Indeed, the plump, juicy lip is definitely juicier, don't you think? Not really plumping. The tart is plumping. It's a little less juicy. Very moisturizing still, but it's not as juicy. So that's your difference. So I wanted to say this was a dupe, but I, I mean, I guess it's a little bit of a dupe, but it's different in that sense. So that's what we need to know is the notes are the elf one is plumping. The tart one is juicier, is juicing. <laughs> the tart one doesn't sting. The elf one does. I mean, it doesn't sting. Um, now, elf's lip glosses, those suckers sting. Just going to let you know. And I don't even know that they were trying to tout it as plumping. They just, their lip glosses sting. Um, this one doesn't sting like their glosses do, but it's just, it's, it's menthol and stingy, so I don't like that part of it, um, but it's it, it's tolerable. Like, it's not, like, bothering me that bad, but, yeah. I mean, it just, it does actually look smoothing and plumping over here, and this one, it's like, I feel like you can see the lines a little bit more, but it's, like, juicier and just feels good. So, I guess it depends on your preference of what you want. All right. 
let's see. Um, I'm going to wipe this off and I did want to swatch the other shades for you, but I already, I think I already swatched them in that shopping haul. So if you want to go back and see the swatches, feel free. Next, I think we're going to move on to the lip oils. Well, let's look into lip oils now. And I want to test this summer Fridays against the e.l.f. Um, lip oils and then maybe a couple of the other lip oils if we have time. But I definitely want to try this Summer Fridays. I'm so excited about it. I haven't put it on my lips yet, so y'all are coming along for the first try. All right. Now we're going to try Summer Fridays. I'm going to do Summer Fridays on this side, and I'm going to start off with Elf on this side. Oh, yes. That is amazing. Mm. It feels so like, like a summer dream. It really does. I don't taste anything really. I mean, like there might be a slight tint of watermelon or something that I'm tasting, but it doesn't really have a scent or smell. But here's how it's looking on the lips. Like I said, I did have on lip liner. I'm going to try e.l.f. Reviver Glow. What is this one? What shade? They are so bad about putting their shades on here. Um, what shade was this, y'all? Pink Quartz. At least this one, but I needed glasses to see it. <laughs> Okay, I'm not gonna lie, like I love, I'm lo in love with these new e.l.f. Reviver lip oils, um, but I almost tasted the slightest bit of menthol on this one too, but it's not bad at all. It's not like the, the plumping one. So here we go. Which one feels better? They both feel amazing, but man. That's Summer Fridays. Woo, woo! It is, it is like a silky dream. I see what everybody's talking about. I do. Was it worth $40? Nah. <laughs> but, because if, if you see that other um, haul that I did, I spent $40 on this oil just to get it. It, just, it is, it's very like silky and just glides and just it's like I don't even know how to describe it it's like a silky dream and then the elf side like it it feels great too but it's just it's not as silky but it's still super moisturizing and feels amazing so summer friday still definitely wins but elf is a good contender man um do you notice a difference in my lips at all I feel like it's like, does it look smoother to y'all right here than this side? You know, honestly, I feel like the elf side might even be smoother, but the summer Friday sure, sure feels good. It's like, it doesn't even feel like a lip balm or oil. It there's, you don't really feel like oil. You just feel like this silky, you just feel like your lips are like silk rubbing each other. Like, oh, it's. It's like a glass dream. It's like glass. Like, they're like, yeah, it's, it's amazing. I have to admit. Okay. All right. Let's try this Eloise. I've still got on the summer Fridays, but I just kind of took off the elf. Mm. I love the scent on this Eloise. It smells so good. So good. It feels good too. I don't know. Ugh. Okay. 
That's a tough call. The Eloise almost feels a little silky also. But it's like a thinner... It's a different formula of silk, but it feels like silk. I might almost like the Eloise better than even the Elf, and I love the Elf. But see, what I also love about it is that the Eloise is scented so nice. So it's like these very kissable lips. If your honey kisses you, they are going to taste this sweetness. So I love that. And then you smell it and taste it too all day. So Summer Friday leads, but then I think Eloise might be in second. Yeah. All right. Let's see what's next. Um, then I'm going to try my Glow Easy Nourishing Vitamin C oil that I love so much from I Do Care. And then we'll move on to the last thing, which is these like jelly ones. Okay. I've, I'm at the point where I'm not even worrying about like making everything look perfect again. <laughs> I just want to feel it on my lips. Okay, that one's a thinner feeling. This one had a slight, like, tiniest bit of berry, but not, like, a lot. Yeah. So, this one's much thinner. I'm going to put this in the last place. Yeah. I mean, I still love it, but just in comparison. See, these are all my, like, favorite lip oils, by the way. So, even if I'm ranking them, like, bottom or whatever... They're still amazing lip oils, so don't think that I'm knocking it. All right, I'm going to wipe off my lips, and we're going to move on to the jelly category. All right, guys, this time I don't think I'm even going to, like, put a liner on. I'm just, I just want to see how it feels on the lips. So, which one should I go with? Um, so, in the YLS, we have Speak Love, and we have, I can't remember the name of this one. The one's like a, a OG and lovable. The OG is more like orange, but it really comes out more clear. And then you have a lovable that's a lot darker. I'm going to go with the lighter, I think. So we're going to go ahead and do the LYS. And so these are more of like the jelly, like messy tubes, basically. I'm going to put LYS over here. Very hydrating, but messy hydrating. So these are, you know, more like a jelly finish. And then, which one should I go with? I'll go with the lighter one for now, the Juicy Tubes. This is the shade Dreamsicle. And we're going to put it on this side, Lancome. That one goes everywhere. Okay. Okay. Now the dream sickle has like sparkles in it. I forgot about that. Uh, sticks to your lips, huh? So yeah, the dream sickle's a little like almost cloudier, a little thicker. The LYS is a little like clearer feeling, a little thinner. And you can just tell from like how it looks on my lips. And I love both and both are messy. Hmm. Um, see that film that the, the Lancome's giving? Like, I mean, I love these juicy tubes and I, I've actually used them on clients, um, especially like little sparkly ones, but I don't know. I'm thinking that LLIS might be winning this one. I just think I prefer the finish. It's not as thick, you know? Like, it's a little bit thinner. So, I think LYS might be it. So, I think that's everything for now, guys. Um, I just wanted to kind of do a little battle of everything and, and test them out. Because uh, these were kind of like my favorite ones within each of these, like, moisturizing categories. And I wanted to do a little face off. And so what did y'all think? So yes, um, I just, I think we especially want to clarify that these e.l.f. 
clout pins are plumping, whereas the tart ones are juicing. Okay, so there is a difference. So very similar in feel, but they're doing different things. Okay, so I just want to make sure you know that. <clears throat> Besides that, we're good. And that Summer Fridays is the dream that everybody says it is. I can confirm. <laughs> okay, guys, that wraps it up. I hope you enjoyed it. I had some fun and I love when I can just do a battle like side by side like this. It really helps me know for sure how to really compare instead of having to go from memory and all. Um, hope that was helpful for you guys too. Have you tried any of these and do you agree? What are your thoughts on it? How would you have ranked them? Let me know in the comments below. Make sure you stick around. Pop that subscribe uh, for more like this in the future. I like to do fun stuff like this ever so often. And I also cover a lot of beauty boxes, unboxings, spoilers, try-ons, lots of makeup here. So you don't want to miss it. And yeah, I'll catch you guys on the next one. Bye.